Today we launch the second annual induction season for the American Manufacturing Hall of Fame. I'm not going to take up too much of your time uh, because we've got a lot to cover in a little over an hour. Uh, as a co-founder of the American Manufacturing Hall of Fame, I'd like to formally welcome you to our event and remind you of our mission, which is to raise awareness of the positive aspects of advanced manufacturing and what it brings to our communities and to raise funding to train the next generation of advanced manufacturing students to create middle-class jobs. You're going to hear a lot of positive things about advanced manufacturing this morning, so let's get started. I'd like to introduce our MC for the event, uh, Christopher P. P. McCormick. First, I would just like to acknowledge some of the uh, elected officials and their, their staffs that were able to come today. Um, Tony Wong is uh, our state senator, and he is going to be part of our panel. Steve, Str Steve Strafston, a uh, state rep, uh, recently elected. Um, from Senator Murphy's office, we have Evan Johnson. And for Representative Himes' office, we have Tyrone McClain. Uh, Chris McCormick is beginning his third year as the president of the Houstonic Community College Foundation. He has served on many professional and community boards over the years and is very active in the community. Professionally, he serves his clients as counselor and advocate in environmental law, environmental litigations, and complex commercial litigation as a partner at Pullman and Comley here in downtown Bridgeport. On a personal note, Chris is a very talented musician and has raised a family very active in the arts. Please join me in welcoming Chris McCormick this morning to lead our meeting. 